I always wondered what it would be like if I turned a massive open world game into a realistic survival game. And so, I did that. Installing multiple mods in order to create the most realistic version of Red Dead Redemption 2. And these mods are so realistic that, yeah, you can also pee. And of course, it wouldn't be an entertaining video without a little challenge. That being said, the video ends when I die. And yes, yes, it, it is, it is that serious. It is. All I have on this island is a bow and arrow, one health cure bottle, and then lastly, a knife. The first few days were pretty decent. I collected materials from my base, I ate some food that I packed, and well, I, um... But then, things started to get a little crazy. I found where I wanted to have my base. This is not your typical baby base. It is the best base you will ever lay your eyes on. And it's called the Survivalist Crib. So, I got to work on that. On day 8, I found out that I wasn't the only one on this island. There was an entire civilization of people working, they also had guards on standby, they had crops, and most importantly of all, they had food, so that was pretty interesting to me. And after three long days of building and sleeping and building and it was done. And ladies and gentlemen, I present to you, The Survivalist Crib. Nah, 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 let me catch one of you making fun of this base in the comments. Nah, seriously, let me let me catch one of you making fun On day 11, I knew I needed to go on a little journey and find out what those people might have been up to. I came over to this village for one reason and one reason only. Knowledge. I had no idea what was on this island and how the island was laid out. So, I needed some more info. But I ended up finding somebody and we really hit it off. You what? Not, not in that way, but like he was he was like a friend way. So, uh, what'd you, uh, what'd you say your name was? My name is Milk Wheat. Well, nice to meet you! Milkweed was actually pretty cool. So cool, in fact, we actually got some dinner together and headed back to my camp. Milkweed, it's a lizard! Ah. Alright, Milkweed, looks like we got a lizard tonight, my friend. Let's head back to my spot. Alright, my friend, here it is. Home, sweet home. So yeah, I mean, we don't have much, but... It's something. Let me make a camp for you. This place is gross. Oh, you're gonna you're gonna make a campsite for me? Thanks, man. Nothing like some lizard, am I right? Unfortunately, I am on a no lizard diet because my sister died from one last year. Oh my god. I um I'm I'm sorry to hear that. We even shared some of our first laughs together. <laughs> Milkweed, oh my gosh, I'm also a virgin. <laughs> but ultimately, he had to go back to his village. But on day 14, Things started to change a little bit between Milkweed and I. Oh, morning, Milkweed. <laughs> Should you be back at the village? Yes, but I need to show you something that's important. See, I've been playing this game for over 10 hours, and by now, everything was feeling very, very real. So real, in fact, that it felt like Milkweed was telling me something within the game. So this is where you work all day, stacking these boxes. Man. Yes, but I need to escape. What? You heard me right. Everyone is so mean to me. I am treated like trash. I want to start a new life in Saint Denis. I am tired of being a pushover. Though Milkweed deep down isn't necessarily real, for some reason he felt more real than anybody I have ever met. So on day 15, the plan was simple. First, build up enough resources to take down this village by any means possible. We would then rob a huge ship located on the edge of the island, make it all the way to Saint Denis Dock where Milkweed would be free start his new journey. But first, I, uh, I gotta go pee. <laughs> Alright. On day 17, I started to create arrows. If we were going to take down the village, we needed some serious firepower. But Milkweed let me know a little secret. What was that, Milkweed? There is a house full of weapons. If we are quiet, we could grab some. Milkweed, my friend, I think we have a plan. We would head into the village late at night when everyone was asleep. Sneak in and grab as much weapons as we possibly could, further helping our chances of helping Milkweed escape the island. Okay, so Milkweed, you're sure that there's some ammo and stuff in there? Yes. Right, okay, here we go. Where are the weapons at? Where are the weapons at? <gasps> oh my god, you weren't joking, Milkweed. Look at how this dynamite shotgun is great for hunting. Oh my god, oh my god. What's the best way to get out of here? Probably the front door. Front door, okay. I can't see... <gasps> somebody saw me, Milkweed. Somebody saw me. Milkweed, somebody saw me. What are we gonna do? Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't let them see me, so take the weapons and get out of here what now. Do you mean get out of here. Milkweed, look out! Oh my god. I gotta get out of here. I have to go now. I have to go now. Oh my god. Okay. No! Oh my god, I gotta go back. I gotta go back. 
It's safe to say that these people were not very happy that I took their weapons, so I booked it as fast as I could, made it through the woods, and luckily was able to make it home safely. Home sweet home, I guess. Guess I'll have to see Milkweed later. After the crazy night I had before, I knew I needed to let the tension die down, so I decided to focus my attention on generating a better way to get food. But I have to be cautious of the bad animals on this island. Milkweed let me know that there are flesh-eating bears, vicious wolves, terrifying cats, but not this cat. Not this cat. He's just adorable. Aren't you? Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Okay. I spent the next few days carefully eating the rest of the food that I had, and I was building traps all around the areas to hopefully catch wildlife. I even tried to go hunting around my area, and this is kind of how it went. Well, I've been traveling for most of the day now, and um, it's raining now, so I finally got a little bit of clean, but I haven't been able to see anything. All I want is just a sign of something. <gasps> oh my god! Deer. At this exact moment, I had the opportunity to secure food for two weeks. So this was going to be the biggest bow and arrow shot of my entire life up until this point in the challenge. You've got to be kidding me. Oh my god. I ended up ultimately going home empty handed, but when I got back to camp, things started to get just a little weird. Okay, I actually don't know where it is that it's making- Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, there's a bear. There's a bear right there. If I can kill this, I only have four arrows because I was did terrible hunting today, but this would make up for so many things. Oh god. Oh god. Um. Um. No, 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 no! Oh my god! Oh my god! Please kill Please kill it. Please kill it. No! <gasps> Run, Arthur! Run, Arthur! Ah! Oh my god! Oh my god, run, Arthur, run! Run, Arthur, run! It's not worth it! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's swinging at me. I'm gonna lose stamina. Can I hit it with dynamite? Please. Where'd go? Look at my back! Oh my god! Take that. Please. Oh, I gotta get this. I just need to get close enough for a shot. It just keeps running away. No, I missed my one shot. We're just gonna have to knife it. I know it sounds stupid, but we're gonna have to get close enough to where we can knife it. Or if I can find my one bow. Oh, where's my arrow? Okay. Let's get my arrow back. Are we? We finally got it. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! I did it, but I was extraordinarily I had no choice but to use my last and only first aid kit that I packed and went to sleep in the shed nearby. Over the next few days, I mastered my hunting skills, but I knew I needed to focus on the main problem, and that was helping Milkweed escape. It's been quite a long time, so I decided to go down and meet him. Milkweed, how you doing, buddy? I've missed you. What's up? Uh, what's been going on? They found out it was me who helped you with the weapons. They are going to kill me. As I should have known, being gone for so long probably wasn't the best idea, because now things were a little bit crazier than I thought. That night, we utilized the resources that we collected on day 22. Over the next couple of days, we carefully placed bombs all throughout the village. And on day 33, it was the day of Milkweed's escape. Alright, Milkweed, today's the day. You sure you want to go through with this? Yes, I am. Even more sure than when I gave me sister that lizard to eat last year. Wait, but didn't... Whatever. This is it. Oh my god. Come on, Milkweed! This is it, my friend! For Milkweed! Good job, Milkweed! Oh no! 
They took it. They took the dynamite down at this point It actually did feel like I was breaking one of my best friends out of a situation that they didn't want to be in So real in fact, I was actually having a hard time distinguishing what was real and what wasn't real. Bill Queen, where are you? Oh my god I'm gonna lie, guys. I think I might have lost Milkweed. This place has gone absolutely to hell right now. Oh my gosh, there's still more coming. There's still more coming. Honestly, I think Milkweed might have died, y'all. I have no idea where he is. Hopefully, I can lose him in this in the cornfield here, whatever this is. I have no idea how they can even see me right now. And they're somehow, some way hitting me. Okay. No! Get out of here for Milkweed! Milkweed! What the heck just happened? Oh no. Milkweed? How did I get- Wait. This is camp. How did I get back here? Milkweed? <gasps> Milkweed! You saved me! Of course you're my brother. Oh my god. You beautiful, magnificent creature. I think it is officially time that you and I celebrate. We ended up spending what felt like just a couple days together, but in reality, it was actually weeks. We've been hunting together. Good job, Milkweed. Bacon tonight. We went sightseeing together. Thanks for being my new best friend. Me too, buddy. We even went on a little competitive race. First person to that tree right there wins. Set, I get a head start. Ah! <laughs> don't beat me, don't beat me, don't beat me. Ah, let's go. Uh, maybe next time, Milkweed. You cheated. Oh, don't be a sore loser, dude. Good lord, come on. And we had plenty of nights where we had drinks by the fire. No, dude, she told me she was 18, but it's like, it's whatever. Yes, but that still doesn't explain why that was your sister. But on day 51, we faced a huge problem. Wake up. Mm, what? Milkweed, what? What? What's the problem, man? What, what? What's going on? I think the army knows it was me that escaped. If we don't leave this island, soon we will both be dead. Milkweed took me to a secret location to where we could observe the guards. Okay, Milkweed, can you tell me exactly why we're at this area? This is where the guards are every day. So what, we're just having to study these guys? Yes. There is a boat that comes every Monday that we can take. Every Monday? Hey, that's tomorrow. We can do this tomorrow. We ended up studying the guards every single day, figuring out what location, what building, and what route they would take. We ended up taking notes on every single thing that they did, and we came up with the best possible plan to escape on the boat and head to St. Denise. The only thing that was left was for us to take action. All right, Milkweed, this is it, buddy. Now listen, but listen, you gotta follow me. Gosh, there's somebody already here. Oh my gosh, Milkweed, they're already on us! Oh my god, we're gonna die. Milkweed! Milkweed! Come on, buddy! No, what are you doing? What are you doing? Milkweed? Milkweed, are you okay? No, they shot me. You're bleeding. Milkweed, we gotta get out of here. Come on. Follow me, buddy. Let's go. We're almost there, buddy. Let's go. Wait. What's going on? Milkweed, what's going on, man? I am sorry, I am just so scared. I know, but we have to go now. Let's go! Down here, Milkweed! Just let me get in the boat! No! Okay, come on, come on, Milkweed! We're almost to the boat, buddy! We're almost there! We're almost free! Who's that? Oh my god, Milkweed behind you! Run, I will hold them off. I can't leave you! Milkweed, come back! That's it, I'm going for my friend. Milkweed, what are you doing? I told you to run. I am shot and might not make it. I will die for you, my brother. Milkweed, you don't have a gun! No! No, Milkweed! Oh my god! Milkweed! We gotta go, buddy! Get away from him. We're leaving together, come on! I'm making you come with me, let's go! I think I hear more coming down the hill, we're gonna have to go fast, Milkweed! Milkweed, they're here, we gotta go! Milkweed! As silly as it sounds, 
at that exact moment, I had a flashback of every single moment that I had with Milkweed. So, uh, what'd you, uh, what'd you say your name was? My name is Milkweed. Don't beat me, don't beat me, don't beat me. Ah, let's go! Good job, Milkweed. Bacon tonight, thanks for being my new best friend. You saved me! Of course you're my brother.